All right, Delivery Tuesday. We got some batches of new batteries and stuff. And today I wanna to show you these guys right here. Look at these. New, actually this is the first time that we got anything like these. All right, look at these. We got a few boxes of these brand new Tenergy lithium ion. They're 2,600 milliamp hours. But the interesting thing is that they're these are rewraps, right? So Tenergy rewraps them. And then they put this button top in here, right? So these came out of brand new equipment. I think it was a flashlight uh, or a some kind of sensor. I don't remember. Uh, the Our source mentioned it, but I don't know. But I think it's like you can put them in flashlights and stuff and they require the little button top. So that's what these are great. So they're consumer grade electronics, right? And they're kind of they're not that popular I, ha I have never gotten any and this is the first load that we got and let's go test them at uh yeah let's go test them see how out, out of the 2600 million these are supposed to be brand new because whatever product they came out of they it ended up not being able to sell it or something they got discontinued or something so then they took them off and then they packaged them back into these boxes right so there we go let's test them all right, let's look at these Tenergies. They're finished. Look at that, 2807, 2681. And they do fit on the uh, just regular chargers, you know, dischargers, testers, right? So look at that, these test pretty good. Uh, they're supposed to be brand new, like I said, because they came out of uh, unused equipment, right? And they have the button. So, yeah, if you want to put them on, like, in a flashlight, these are good for that sort of stuff. Um, that it's, like, um, consumer-grade products, right? So, yeah, these don't come around too often. We got a little batch of them, so there we go. All right, so I want to see what's inside of these cells because, you know, I always know that these are rewraps, essentially, right? Tenergy doesn't make batteries. Well, I guess it could you know, partner up with some small Chinese uh, shop and then uh, manufacture cells and then they can rewrap them and put their name, right? But maybe, maybe they don't. Maybe they use one of the five, big five, right? So here we go. I'm going to take, that comes with a big clear and then it's got this other one. So let's take that one apart and see what's inside. All right, so... I already made a cut here. Where are you? Cut. Come on, cut. There we go. So when you're doing this, you should do it towards the back. Because that's where... Ooh, look at that. See that? Okay, and this is where you have to be careful because both positive and both negative are close on the top of over here. So they're very, very close. Okay. Ah, oh, look at that. So I guess they are just generic Chinese batteries, right? So they're not name brand. Um, and the reason why they have this, it's because this little circuit board, they have, they do have a BM, uh, a BMS board here on board, <laughs> on board BMS. Let me get the, um, so here we go. So they have this, uh, to protect, right? Cause this is the positive. And it's gonna come, and the whole cell uh, is a, it's a negative, so they have to isolate it. And by the way, this little top thing here is just spot welded, and then they add an extra thing. So that's the only thing they just spot weld an extra little button, and then they add this little thing. That's why these are a bit. Um, longer than average battery, right? Than the regular. And I guess these are what they're known, commonly known as protected cells. 
button tops protected cells okay so here we go we take off that thing boom and you see that now that is a that is a BMS now a 1S BMS it basically prevents the battery from over discharging or over current uh, yeah so these are protected energy protected cells right and of course they're their own brand their own little thing or whatever so but they check out pretty good as we saw on the uh so there you go this is the first time that we get uh protected 18650 cells right people have been asking me now than me about these for a long time and i'd be like no i never seen any well there we go now we have seen some they're here they're perfect for flashlights are perfect for i don't know, other other little consumer devices right um so if you need them there you go they're gonna be a jack 35 thank you for watching this video we'll see you guys on the next one bye